Hello everyone and welcome back to part 8, no, yeah, is it 8? Uh, some episode, I think it's 8 or 9, I am the farming man, I know I haven't uploaded for a bit, I've just been busy, as normal, but I've managed to get a bit more done this evening, so today we're going to go out and spread some manure, so we're going to take this, little beast, I sold the fence, My game volume's way low. It's all about thirty. There we go. Now you can. Now we can sort of hear it. So we're going to put the little spreader on it. We're just sort of going to use some of this up just to sort of make a change. Make it. It'll feel a bit different. Instead of just using the uh, solid ones all the time. Not solids, the um, fertilizer out the thing. Oh, fuck me. No, tractor. Right, let's try putting this into a place that won't fuck it up. I reckon like that. But that'll probably take even longer to fill. So, yes, I've also stacked all these round bales I, I made. Just to make sure we've got enough. I stacked them all in that big bale shed the what the other one was in. No what the shit. No, 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 wrong way. Stacked them all in the shed that the uh oh, what was it? So it should take two of these to fill it up. The shed that the uh None of that go. You have to get it in a, sp a, s uh, a certain spot, don't you? Wait, did any of that actually go in? Well, we've got 29%, and it's only f and it should be more than that. I've also got liquid manure, which I can do anyway. So if we run out of this, hopefully we won't. Oh, eh? But if we do, I will put some liquid manure down as well. It's just to use these machines, really. It makes a change. I'm just going to leave it like that. I don't care how long it takes to load. I think the trigger for it's in the middle. Ah, uh, there we go. How much is that? We've got one field of canola to fertilise. And yes, I have planted near enough all of them with canola. To try and get some money. Because once we've got some money, we can get some more cows. Once we've got more cows. Fuck me. Once we've got more cows, we can... Oh my god, what the hell is it doing? Game. What the actual fuck is happening? How the fuck did I manage that? Right. So what I'll probably do is after I've harvested the canola, feed them loads of grass, straw, silage, whatever. And just leave my fast forward time until it maxes it out. Till I cannot actually have any more and it should be okay then. That'd be quite fun. So it's, oh, it's sort of on the middle bar. Keep leaning in. Come on. The second you can hear this little like sound as it hits the floor, that's what you got here for. That means it's going in. Oh no, she's full. Alright, let's get out. Let's walk to the tractor. Around the other side. I haven't even had to use that. That's the thing I'm on about. The forage wagon, that's it. Let's go. I can't even remember how to get to that. Oh, you have to go through your field. What is it? Full? Yeah. So, yeah, I stacked 80. 
82 bales, round bales. Brought them in with that auto stacker. Stuck them all in the shed. They're all perfectly stacked. So hopefully they should stay like that. This is quite far away. I probably should make like a buy a heap with well, a different mod and then stick it all in the field, but really the farm's not that far away. Let's pull in. So you have to go through this field to get to the next one. But also I want to show you some mods I've got. Go to tractors, they're all tracks mods. In season four, these will be making an appearance and we're gonna get completely get rid of all the tracks we've got now and have these. Probably them. Is there any more I downloaded? Nope. I'm probably with that again because it's nice. What else did I download? Oh yes, in this. A milk tanker. But also, I downloaded these, which is probably the worst I do. The incubator I might get. It means we can only have, we only have to buy like a few chickens, and then we can just get loads and loads off it. So there's our case ready to for what's it, this field. See, this is what I'd kind of need all the manure for this field here. Just all of it, just to do this. Right, I have absolutely no idea. Yeah, I think you have to go around the outside, don't you? So I think you go round like that. So turn it on. So you go round the outside. I'm just sure I could keep going round and round. I have absolutely no idea how to do this. I've only ever done it before with the one that goes right behind you and you drive across the field. I probably should have done this before I started seeding it, but you know, I wanted to do it on camera. And seeding's boring anyway. I had to do it all. I did it all off camera. Probably do it a little bit easier. Turn it off. Reverse. So, absolutely friggin' no idea how to friggin' do this. But you know, it'll be a good try. If I miss bits, it's my very first time. It's not my first time spreading manure in this game, it's just my first time doing this. Doing it this way, with the side one. I don't normally do it like this. That's why I'm not in cab. Uh, right. And around the corner. I do know. I did notice that if you open the side, if you open that panel, it goes a lot higher, so you can spread it out further across the field. And I think it works a lot like mowing as well. If you mow with just a side mow, it like I'll do a headland now, and then finish this headland and then on the next one finish the headland then go up and down the field so you sort of go up one side and then go down it I think that's the way you do it I'm not sure but you know uh, won't hurt to try and yes this tractor will be replaced so will that one for season four Probably get into forestry on a different map. But yeah, we, I picked the smaller equipment to sort of make it a little bit easier. Just so I didn't have to do really hard corners. And all that stuff. So we wanna oh shit, we don't wanna crash into a bloody auto stacker. That's money gone, tractor ruined. Open this. I know in real life these don't open you don't open them like that. I don't think you do. I think you can just nudge it open with the bucket on the loader. That's what the funky farmer does for his and he does real life farming. I do real life farming, I just don't do when you're spreading because there's no need. Because we don't plant any crops, we just do beef. So I have absolute fuck all idea. I'm assuming it's got to be open, so I'm just gonna leave it open. Just turn it off. Just get out of it. Actually, if we leave it on, does it still come up on the thing? Yes, it does. So that might give us a little bit of help of. Oh, helps with this bloody thing, can't it? 
help you might say how much manure's in it. Oh yeah, it does. So now I'd have to keep tabbing into it. I can just sort of do it like this. Alright, try to get that close to it next time. How much manure is actually in it? 10%. It's just quite a bit. Okay, it goes, it goes down quite quick. <laughs> So then we might even have to end up doing this with the slow tanker, which I kind of assumed we would have to, because I didn't. I knew we hadn't got enough manure here, but I will leave it on for about a week in game, probably with everything maxed out, like feed and all that. That'll probably give us a good. Wow, 98. Fuck it, we'll go on 98. It'd be easier. We might get one less run out of it, but I don't really care. Uh, so yeah, um, there's all sorts of things. Loads of new mods have been coming out. They're all quite good. Something for Euro trucks coming out. Like a one point something beta. I don't know what it is. Or it might even just be the update for the game. Haven't looked into it. Uh, what else is that? I'll probably be recording two of these episodes tonight because I just need to get one up. Oh shit, I just. I completely forgot I was recording then. I just cut through the edge. But I'd really hope there was. I hoped. I, I hope in an update there's no fill level, like properly. You can sort of fill these max and just keep filling them up until it overflows, really. That'd be amazing because then you could just be like. You'd probably waste a bit, yeah, you probably would, but then you'd be like able to fertilize more of the field because you'd have more in it. Oh wow, I've missed the smallest strip on the edge I could possibly ever do. There was a bale there, I didn't realize that. Pick that up at some point. Probably not, I'll just leave it there forever. Right, so, no, turn off, piece of shit. Aha, piece of shit. Right, so what I'm thinking you have to do... Oh, fuck it, he's not crashed at the bloody fence posts. Is sort of find the middle of the field. Don't even know where that is. Let's take a random guess here, will do. And then you turn it on. Go down one side. I probably should have started a bit more over to one side, but you don't really bother me. As long as it gets fertilised, that's all I care about. So you go down like this, turn around. The tractor will stop. Okay. Turn around and go like this. This is the way I think you do it when there isn't a crop in the field. But yeah, I am the biggest noob when it comes to this because I have no idea. It's just, it's getting the directions right because if this is what you've got to do, then I'm alright. Well, I don't have to do anything else. And yeah, I'm missing bits on that. I will probably swap to the other one eventually. Like the other. Well, there's only 9% in here, I might as well just. So, sort of just go around the outside and get the bits I've missed. Swap to the bigger one, which is the big 100 and something horsepower. I think. I think it is. It's only 110. This tracks is 115. So I could probably get on the back of this. As of that one holds a lot more and I think has a lot a little bit bigger spreading width than this one does. 
but yeah as I say you can open it like that and it will go further out which means it might give it a bigger sp spread distance but other than that I don't know um, so yeah we probably haven't even got enough to do one more run with this so I'm going to just park it up and get the slurry tanker out and just do that So yeah, I hope you're all enjoying this series. I know this I know it hasn't been up I haven't uploaded for days. Just been busy as hell, man. Work and stuff, school and all that shit. You know. Just been super busy. So sorry about that. Yes, we shall be carrying on as best we can. So we might as well just leave that thing there for now. The slurry tankers here. Haven't got any sheep yet, we probably will. The other map we're going to do for season 4 is a surprise, so I'm not going to give it away. But it had. When you start, it gives you 50 sheep and 50 cows, so we will be able to just jump right in and have 50 cows. Which will probably just double up to 100 anyway. We probably have. We'll probably have to buy some really big equipment because it's got some massive fields in. Wow, only three percent in that. Jesus. God, I hope this is worth it. I hope that this actually becomes an episode and it's worth it. It'll probably be a bit short. I'm going to shorten them down. 30 minutes is a bit long. So I thought about 20, in the 20s somewhere. So like 26, 27, 28, something like that. Just sort of get, try and get something done every episode. But this will be done. Hopefully this we can get this done in this episode. I have got a tractor, I think, hooked up to the fertilizer. So if we actually run out of manure and liquid manure or slurry then we can be okay but because then I've always got then I can just fertilize the field with that but yeah the, probably the best way to go is liquid manure for now and then wait till we've got loads of manure because it takes loads even on these really small fields it takes loads that was two runs that we've run out already But the best thing about this is you can hire a worker on this slurry tank, which we're not going to do because it's pointless. It's pointless when I can just do it myself. I don't even know how big the run is. So I think it can be this big. So it's got a, l a bigger spreading width, which is always good. Now, the update for this game, I don't know whether they put it in, because I've got the mod for hide workers use seeds and that, and use fuel, but I don't know whether they added it in, in the game just as a stock thing, so they always do it constantly with even out the mod. So I might take the mod out and see what happens. Because if they haven't, then I can take my mod off and basically just fill that big trailer up once, fill this up once, and just hire a worker. The work can go up and down for a bit. So yeah, how many we managed to get three runs done in one tank, so we'll probably get this field done. And yeah, I'm just going to spread the last little bit on the bits I've missed. Right, so I hope we get this finished now. If not, I'll just do the last little bit off screen. You, you kind of get the idea, well, you should have the idea by now. But liquid manure and slurry are free because you don't have to pay for it but you 
have to pay for cows and the equipment to feed the cows which so it probably adds up more money it probably makes more it probably has gives you more, it takes more money to do and more time but yet the outcome of it is you get two things free basically that's what it is two things free for a baler the slurry tanker itself the manure spreader that's three things the bale lift the uh, auto stacker for the baler tractor to run the baler slash auto stacker slash everything else uh, and the front load well if you if you saw go down the um, this route of buying a front loader then you sort of save yourself buying a tele handler to fill up the thing but yet you still got to buy the attachments for it mm, that's the other problem So yeah, we will be changing all vehicles apart from that JCB because I like it. It's a very good front loader, telehandler thing. Unless something else comes out that's pretty interesting and really good, then that will be the one of choice. Unless like a really good front loader or a really good telehandler comes out, then we'll pick one of them. But we're going to have a massive harvester on that on that game. Or at least two, two of the other ones. At least two of the New Hollands. At least we're gonna at least need two, because it's got some fucking big fields in it. Excuse my language. It's got some real big fields in it. I think the biggest one would take like a whole 30 minute episode. No, probably not even that. A 30 minute episode would probably do about half. That's with two harvesters. Big field, bigger than this. This is probably like the smallest field in the map. There's two cornfields. I'm, I'm just giving you hints here. There's two cornfields, and it was released on FSUK. So you should get it by now. If you don't, then there'll be a link in the description to the map on episode one of it when it gets released, which won't be till I've done 15 episodes on this, which is my goal to do 15. We're only on episode eight. So I'm going to have to start picking up the pice. Because I've done ten to it. I've done ten episodes for each season, but I kind of want to get a bit higher. And as I've got basically two years, because they only release these things every two years. should be some incredible mods being made. I was thinking last night should I go back to Farmers in 13 and finish a season on that, but really ain't no point. I mean there's loads of good mods out there for it. Don't get me wrong, the Ford Force and all that are really good. I'd love them to be in 15. I'll probably finish this side if I can. Well, I'll finish to the end of this tanker and then I'll end the episode because it's getting really boring. It'd be something really boring to watch. I know it's that's kind of sounds harsh on my own work, but that's kind of true. You ha if you like farming, you've got to like everything. Well, not like everything, you've got to not... I find bits of farming boring, but I don't like, hate it. That's the word I'm looking for. You, you can't, you don't need to hate it because it's just, this is what we've got to do. Even if I did this with the pellet thing, it'd probably still take... Still take a bit long. It probably take take a bit li less. Right anyway, let's leave it here. Sod it. Right. So yeah. Anyway, uh, sorry I haven't been uploading recently. Things have been getting in the way. I will be uploading this week and sat on on the weekend. Probably a live stream on the weekend as well. So thank you all so much for watching. Uh, like, comment, rate, and subscribe. The vibes. And I will see you all in the next episode.